And um, and what's crazy as a stat is of that 150 million, 50% are from Armenia. Speaking of checking sources, you want to hear something funny? So I was looking uh, into all the social media stuff, right? And I was looking at numbers for threads and I was cross-checking a bunch of things just to make sure the numbers were actually right. Okay. And one of the, the websites I was using to primarily talk about threads, not this one, but another one, um, was basically it was talking about how threads has grown and so again the the whole point of the story was like wow threads is gigantic and we just kind of don't realize it they have 150 million people that are being that are using this like every month or whatever and um and what's crazy as a stat is of that 150 million 50 percent are from armenia that's not true right Armenia has three million people, <laughs> and so I was like, "That just can't." According to this that. website, very confidently is just stating, oh, "Yep." Yeah. And we know, looking at the data, that Armenians are about half of them, uh, half of the hundred fifty million people. So what? each, so either Threads is growing, kind of spread around the world, or every single Armenian person has has, multiple. has thirty Threads <laughs> accounts that they are personally running. What I learned from this is that it is very hard to get accurate numbers on social media, and it's it's mostly estimates. So oh, it this is, happened it, to me when I worked in marketing all the time. You, you, dude, so much of this stuff is fluff or empty or. And you'd have to give these pitches on like the growth of platforms to your executive, and it would just be you, you're just like you're just fudging it. You're just, there's, no, there's no there's no numbers. They don't publish it. Um, nobody knows. Nobody 